When processing musical and speech sounds, all the circuits of the electroacoustic receiving path through the microphone, studio equipment, sound transmission, reproduction paths to loudspeakers and stereo headphones distort musical and speech sounds. The modern audio and video industry faces the problem of designing such equipment and using such signal processing algorithms that produce the least possible distortions. Distortions fall under linear and non-linear. Linear distortions are accounted for by amplifying reactive components, that is, capacitors and inductances whose resistance depends on the frequency. They result from uneven amplitude frequency characteristic of an amplifier and its nonlinear phase frequency characteristic. Linear distortions do not affect amplitude ratio in the amplified signal. If signal linear distortions occur in an amplifier, the, an amplitude undergoes noise distortions. That's why linear distortions are often called frequency distortions. They keep properties that they do not induce any components in the output signal spectrum. Linear distortions affect amplitude phase ratios between existing spectral components, thus distorting its temporal pattern. Such changes are called tone distortions of sound coloration. Probably one of the most illustrative examples of linear distortions includes such TV image distortions as changes in luminance, dynamic range, luminance, chromaticity discrepancies, and double contours. Rather a good solution to detecting noticeable linear distortions in the amplifier is to transmit rectangular pulses to the amplifier's input and monitor the output signal format using an oscilloscope. The leading edge of the rectangular pulse is extremely sensitive to uneven amplitude frequency characteristic and nonlinear phase frequency parameter. Noticeable linear distortions will considerably affect the waveform of rectangular pulses, which is clearly seen on the oscilloscope display. Such a simple test is to some extent an alternative solution to examination of amplitude, frequency and phase frequency amplifier parameters.